right over to Wabakrong. Our big sale will it? Can you think of any better way to spend our lives? Dude, I can't even think. Is my heart still beating? <sighs> Keep flicking. Listen, guns, ball. The world will end in 24 hours, so look for the signs. Hmm, that was strange. Yeah. The end is near! The end is near! The end is near! The end is near! Four hour discount sale, so hurry up! <laughs> That's weird. Where do you think all those birds are going? What? Uh, you want my sandwich? Here, you can have it. Please let me go! Okay, there's something going on here. Yeah, first there was this weird message from the TV. Then the weird guy with a sign. And now the animals are acting weird. What's going on? Greetings, organic units. Would you be interested in signing up for the Science Club excursion to watch the solar eclipse in exactly 24 hours? 24 hours? Uh, what exactly happens in a solar eclipse? The sun will be engulfed by the moon and the world will be thrust into a complete and unnatural darkness. Whoa! <laughs> and, uh, is this going to be, like, like a bad thing? Well, the Mayans believed that it would signify the end of the world, but of course that was before the advent of science. The end of the world! Yes, but obviously, it is just primitive nonsense. In 24 hours! Please, let me finish. We're doomed! <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. 24 hours? Oh, this is horrible! All the things I wanted to do in my life! All my plans! Ruined! Ruined! <laughs> you know, I've been thinking. 24 hours is actually quite a long time. Hey, you're right. I mean, how many minutes are there in an hour? Like 60? So that's like 60 times 24, which is 3 billion seconds. That's like ages. We've got to make every second count. You know, Darwin, I've never asked you, but what do you want to do with your life? What are your hopes and dreams? Who is Darwin Watterson? Well, I guess what makes me happy is helping other people who are less fortunate than ourselves due to circumstances beyond their control. So I'd like to start a charity for... Where are you going? Dude, I don't think the end of the world is time to get charitable. And besides, you're getting kind of boring. I think we'd be better off doing some of the things I want to do. Darwin, what are we doing here? Learning car. So we can get a career, a home, and feed our children in the future. Darwin, there is no future. We need to make the most of it right now. Not listen to some baboon drone on about algebra. Oh, gumball. This is biology. Oh, who cares? It won't matter in 24 hours. Kiss me, Penny. <clears throat> I've got a surprise for you today, children. A surprise test. <laughs> A surprise for you. I'm not gonna do the test because it's the end of the world and nothing matters anymore. Not even this. <gasps> How's that for a surprise? <laughs> so come on, everybody. Let's turn our last day on Earth into the biggest party ever. On second thoughts, spending three hours in detention wasn't the best use of our time. Ugh, oh, I'm gonna be late for my wedding now. Wedding? Yes, Darwin, my wedding. By the power of the banana, it is my duty to ask if there's anyone here who sees any reason why Gumbo and Penny should not be joined in marriage. Speak now or forever hold your peace. Actually, I've got more than one reason. Firstly, I'm 12, and so are you. Secondly, you didn't even propose to me. You're just trying to marry me in the school corridor. Hey, guys. Happy wedding. And finally, this is not a wedding ring. It's a bagel. But you know what? That shouldn't stop you from asking me again in 20 years. <gasps> but you don't have 20 years. Shh. I love her too much to let her know the truth. 